Israel's shipyards made a huge impact at the Asian Defense and Security Adash, 2024 exhibition by showcasing the Saar S-80 multirole corvette, a highly advanced naval platform that could become a game-changer for the Philippine Navy. With impressive firepower, flexibility, and cost efficiency, the Saar S-80 stands out as an ideal solution for the country's maritime defense modernization. Even more intriguing is the possibility of technology transfer, allowing the Philippines to produce these corvettes locally, boosting both the Navy's capability and the country's defense industry. The Saar S-80 multirole corvette is a prime example of how the Philippines can modernize its naval forces without exhausting its budget. Its compact size, advanced capabilities, and potential for technology transfer make it an ideal platform for the country's defense needs. With the ability to produce this corvette locally, the Philippines has a golden opportunity to build a stronger and more resilient navy, capable of defending its territorial waters and protecting its people. Israel's shipyards offer at Udash 2024 could be the key to unlocking a new era of naval warfare for the Philippines. A fleet of smaller, faster, and deadlier ships that can be produced in numbers, ensuring the nation remains capable of defending its sovereignty and securing its future. Designed for compact but highly capable operations, the Saar S-80 measures 80 meters in length, 11 meters wide, and displaces around 1,000 tons. Despite being smaller than larger frigates, this ship comes equipped with advanced systems and heavy weaponry, making it more than capable of handling high-intensity naval combat. The Saar S-80 is designed for flexibility, it can operate as an independent strike unit or work alongside larger vessels, offering adaptability in various operational scenarios. Its smaller size and lower production cost make it an attractive choice for navies like the Philippines, which aim to modernize while managing budget constraints. A 76mm Otto Malara main gun, perfect for handling surface and air threats of vertical launch system VLS, equipped with four four-cell launchers for Barak-8 missiles, providing strong anti-air and anti-ship capabilities launchers for suicide drones designed for anti-ship and land attack missions, adding another level of lethality Rafael Typhoon 25mm or 30mm cannons for close-range defense against fast attack boats or small vessel space for a helicopter or naval UAV enhancing reconnaissance and surveillance capabilities these advanced weapon systems, combined with the ability to carry two RHIBs, rigid-hulled inflatable boats, for special forces or boarding operations, make it a highly flexible and potent platform. The Saar S-80 isn't just about firepower, it also comes equipped with state-of-the-art technology. Its key features include, an AESA radar for air and surface search, capable of tracking multiple targets simultaneously fire control radar and navigational systems to ensure operational efficiency across various mission profiles in electronic warfare EU, suite, offering offensive and defensive capabilities, including radar jamming, communication disruption, and missile countermeasures these systems provide a strategic edge in both defensive and offensive naval operations, making the Saar S-80 a formidable deterrent in the contested waters of the West Philippine Sea. What truly sets Israel's offer apart is the potential for technology transfer, a feature that would allow the Philippines to produce multiple Saar S-80s locally. This deal not only provides an advanced naval platform but also helps to build the country's domestic defense industry, creating jobs and fostering innovation in the local shipbuilding sector. Being able to manufacture these corvettes domestically would significantly reduce the total acquisition cost while allowing for customization to meet the specific needs of the Philippine Navy. With this technology transfer, the Philippines can begin building a fleet of modern, fast, and lethal corvettes at a much lower cost than larger warships but with significant combat capabilities. As tensions rise in the West Philippine Sea, the need for a modern and capable fleet becomes more urgent. The Saar S-80 offers the perfect solution for the Philippine Navy, 
combining firepower, advanced technology, and cost efficiency. Its ability to operate independently and alongside larger vessels makes it a flexible platform for defending the Philippines' sovereignty in disputed waters. With the opportunity to acquire multiple SAR S-80 corvettes, the Philippines could significantly enhance its naval presence, sending a strong message to potential adversaries. The SAR S-80 is more than just a ship. It represents a strategic shift toward a more modern and capable Philippine Navy, ready to defend the nation's maritime interests for years to come.